Yeah, an older woman, you don't have to jump through hoops with that. She's ready to have sex with you before the date begins. As a matter of fact, that's the only reason she called you over. Because you can take her out and buy her flowers and dinner, but you're just going to escalate that violent nympho that's going to come out of her later on. Because when you get her home and that bedroom door closes, look the fuck out. She'll take her clothes off and already be in some full dominatrix outfit that she managed to slip on in the bathroom at the Outback Steakhouse when you weren't looking. <laughs> And when she does that, you'll go, wow, cool. But right when you're thinking that, she'll pull that cane out of her boot and just whack you across the face with it, right? You've been there, guys, huh? Yeah. And then you go down. She'll jump on top of you, start punching you. You're yelling that word for surrender. Banana, banana. She doesn't give a shit. She'll just keep pounding away. Who's the boss, motherfucker? Who's the boss? Tony Danza, Tony Danza. <laughs> <laughs> to the point where your face is all black and blue the next day. Your friends are like, dude, what happened to you? And you have to go, I fell down the steps. <laughs> but to me, that's hot. That's much more attractive than the young girls with, oh my God, you got it in my eye. Ew, whatever, gross, get away. Ew. OMG, he got it in my eye. <laughs> T-T-Y-L. Facebook, Twitter, post, too much information. <laughs> Stay away from the younger girls. That's why I stick with porn, internet porn. Boom, yeah, the bar's been raised, ladies. Remember when you used to go out to a club and make out with your friend and all the boys are like, whoa, well, sorry, we got internet porn. You think two clothed women making out is going to do anything to a guy that just spent four hours watching a girl take it from three guys from Zimbabwe and a donkey? Hell no. You want our attention, you got to shit in a cup and eat it now. I didn't make the rules. Oh, what's worse, me saying that joke or you getting it? <laughs> Internet porn will fuck you up, too. I can't come anymore unless a clown's chasing me with a knife. <laughs> it started with blacks on blondes, and it just took a left. <laughs> and here I am. Don't worry, I put that on Craigslist when I'm looking for a roommate. Must be okay with me running around with a clown chasing me with a knife. And of course, it's Craigslist, so everyone wants to be my roommate. I'll, I'll be your roommate. Oh, shit. <laughs> Craigslist motto should be Craigslist. <laughs> and if you're going to post something on there, get into it. Like Rocky Horror Picture Show, get into it. Don't give them your phone number. Give them your Skype number. Let them see you so you can dress up. <laughs> Wear a trench coat. You want to come look at my dresser? <laughs> it's all right. I'll just go to Ikea. <laughs> and... <laughs> Welcome to Craigslist. I know, it's creepy. The internet's making everyone the worst possible thing ever. What about selfies? Selfies, what the fuck? Seriously, you know, selfies, the only good thing about them is we have a lot less Asian people asking us to take their pictures. <laughs> But we should never forget that they used to do that. We need a steel shrine of a bunch of Asian tourists handing their camera to a fucking very uncomfortable white guy. Never forget. <laughs> Selfies creep me the fuck out. I mean, I look at a selfie and I think to myself, really, you have no friends? You couldn't find one person to take your picture? Excuse me, can you take my minute? Excuse me, can you take my Fine, I'll just do it myself. <laughs> You expect, no one has ever looked cool in a selfie. Because number one, how are you gonna look cool when we know you just went, wow, I look good today. <laughs> the fuck is wrong with you? Do you even know what narcissism is? It's a spice I keep in my cupboard. No, narcissism is not a spice you keep in your fucking cupboard. It's something that creeps me and other people the fuck out. You seriously want to go on a date with someone who's in their bathroom with shit on their toilet and mold on their shower going... <laughs> it's weird. And let's call out the elephant in the room here. You didn't get that selfie on the first take, did you? You spent 15 minutes of your fucking life going... No. No. 
<laughs> no. Just because you're by yourself doesn't mean you can get to act like a fucking idiot. What the hell is wrong with you? Stop taking selfies. It's weird. <laughs> Oh, remember the old days when the internet didn't make us this way? When we had to watch porn on VHS like everyone else? <laughs> and porn was funny. Remember when it was funny? I miss those days. Where some guy by the name of Titanium Rod would just walk into a kitchen, walk up, bad actor like Keanu Reeves, bad actor. <laughs> just walk in and go, hey, who ate all the pizza? <laughs> Naked girl comes around the corner. I ate all the pizza. Cut to bam, 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 bam. And he starts fucking her. Why? Because she ate all the pizza. <laughs>